Welcome to WTDC 17 here in Buenos Aires, Argentina, where I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Mr. Bokar Bar, who's Chief Executive Officer of the Semina Telecommunications Council. Bokar, great to see you in the studio. Thank you very much for welcoming me. Good morning. Thank you for joining us. Now, I'd like to talk a little bit about uh, subjects close to your heart, telecom operators. They're at the, uh, at the heart of the fast-growing ICT sector. What role do you think that operators can play to ensure the benefits of ICT sector spreads to people everywhere, especially in remote to rural areas? It's a very uh, relevant question and very interesting because when we look at the current situation right now, we are witnessing a transformation in the ICT landscape. We are having some new stakeholders coming in and it takes us to a very complex uh, situation if we look at the value chain. Telecom operators traditionally they have been seen as a stakeholder carrying the traffic. Now today that's not enough and we are going through a major transformation. So. I believe as we go, they will become the uh, digital development enabler. What does it mean? Let's look at the facts. The world has technically internet coverage almost over 90% of the globe. Still, we have less than 50% of the world population connected to the internet, which means that we have to go beyond being a carrier we need to promote the benefits of the internet to the population. Hence, in the remote and rural area, despite the fact that we have to bring connectivity, which is, I believe, very beneficial for the business model, we also have to promote the internet with government. So stakeholders will have and go through a transformation of their role. And I believe, answering your question, telecom operators will be the enabler of the digital development. What are some of the hurdles that are going to be facing operators in spreading the benefits of ICTs? Well, these are the traditional impediment. We talk a lot about need for spectrum. We talk a lot about the OTTs. We talk about infrastructure sharing. These are the traditional hurdles that we have. But during our discussion and as we go, we realize that there is another type of hurdle that we need to overcome, which is making the partnership effective, making the partnership relevant. Uh, the good news is government, they want to work much more with the private sector. Private sector wants to work with the government. So we have to design the partnership and make it effective. Uh, this is what we are looking at right now. And in terms of uh, the ICT sector ex ex expansion, now basically it's rapidly expanding new players don't necessarily uh, need huge infrastructure uh, expanding fast. How are telecom operators addressing this challenge? Well, we are looking at the situation. Uh, we cannot directly address it. What we can is explain the situation to the authorities, to the regulator, to the policy maker. Uh, those new players are welcome in our industry because there is no doubt that they are leading innovation. Population is very happy because uh, they are changing our way of life, the digital life. Now, in terms of business and competition, this is where we need to have a dialogue among all the stakeholders. It's not easy for regulators to come up with proper regulation that will create a level playing field, even though they are working on it. But maybe for the time being, we can have less regulation on the existing telecom operators. The idea is to create a level playing field. And the burden that telecom operators have is on the taxation and levies. It's not an easy subject. Sometimes decision makers are not our direct regulators. Hence, we need to elevate that discussion to a national level make it a national priority across all governments and see how today we can still stimulate the investment without uh, feeling that burden created by the new players in this ecosystem. And finally, I'd like to ask you, what concrete actions would you hope to see come from this WCDC 17? Well, immediate action through some of the resolution that will be put forward by the member states, 
I believe it will be very important uh, as an outcome to have in this WTDC uh, 2017 a real implementation plan with regard to the partnership. Because uh, I am convinced that if the partnership is successful, we can benchmark it, apply it for all the other industries that will be uh, inclusive into the ICT ecosystem. So really we have a great expectation I have about having the right partnership put in place by the ITU through this WTDC. Mokaba, CEO of the Semino Telecommunications Council, thank you very much indeed. Thank you and always a pleasure to be here. Thank you.